Sports Night's latest update has accidentally revealed some secrets that Epic Games does not want us to know about, as well as some minor changes that are about to have a major impact on the game. Hey, uh, yo! No way! A new key card! We are about to receive Fortnite's first major update for Season 3, and uh, the secret item has literally accidentally revealed it already. Fortnite has an upcoming summer event, which happens every year. With the hot weather comes a summer theme, as well as a bunch of new rewards, quests, and sometimes even an event. But Epic Games has given us something that might be revealing this event early. Yo, this key card seems to lead us right into a waterfall. Uh, and as you guys can see, we're actually at Meowsos' secret location. Oh, sorry, Paradise Meowsos. Yo, why is the key card literally leading us right into the waterfall, huh? This is because Fortnite's upcoming summer event is taking place at the Meowsos location. Players have already discovered online major location changes going on at this location. We can literally see Meowsos' face painted on the rock side, as well as Peely's summer blow up rafts and palm trees actually been added by Epic Games. And it seems whatever is going on at this Meowsos location, it's going to be the center hub of this brand new summer update for 2023. We know the summer Meowsos outfit is currently locked, so it does seem this summer event is based around this cute kitten right here. And only now have we found that out to be the truth. Yo, but well, there's only one way to find out. Maybe there's a secret location right behind that waterfall. What has something to do with this upcoming Paradise Meowso summer event? Yo, let's find out. Hey, yo, hold up. Speaking of waterfalls, the water has just started falling from the giant ice chunks in game. In the pre summer event updates, Epic Games has actually started melting these giant ice chunks. And you go see it for yourself. This ice is melting. But the question is why? With the summer events around the corner, maybe things are heating up on our Fortnite island, which is why the ice is melting. But Epic Games has a long history of melting ice and revealing something amazing. Underneath the icy rocks, the snow and ice was melting at the iceberg, revealing the giant Polar Peak Castle all the way back in Chapter 1 of Season 7. We also know that that iceberg actually started to crack open, revealing a giant monster. We might have talked about it once or twice on this channel. We also saw ice melting in the beginning of Chapter 3, revealing the return of Tilted Towers to our Chapter 3 island. Epic Games loves melting ice and revealing something cool underneath it. So what will the ice reveal this time? With the ice melting, what game-changing, mind-blowing update is Epic Games about to bring for us? I'm excited to find out. Yo, not as excited as I am to see this secret waterfall location. Here I come, Meow Souls. Here I come. Holy, what the? What just happened? Hold on. Bro, why is it pushing me back like that? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh my oh god, bro. I can literally hear the sound effect already playing on those trumpets. I can literally hear it. Bro, there is literally nothing behind this waterfall. Then how come this key card is actually leading me to the waterfall if there's nothing there? Why? Okay, okay, okay. I have a confession to make. You're gonna hate me, but remember. But, well, let me just confess first. A Meowsu's key card is expected to make an appearance on boss Meowsu's at this location in the summer update. With Paradise Meowsu's being the main boss at this important location for the summer update, we should expect him to have a secret location, a secret key card, and crazy loot inside. But with us being a couple of the days away from the update, I, uh, I, 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 I just, uh, I, uh, I got one of those key cards that are already in the game, and I, I just, I made it look like, you guys know what I'm saying? I mean, literally, look, it tracks to the closest vault, which is, like, somewhere over there. It's, like, 300 meters, though. That's crazy. I'm sorry. Actually, I'm gonna just test it. I'm gonna test it for science. I don't remember if you can get a key card from this guy. I'm pretty sure I've eliminated him once. Ah, who am I kidding? We're gonna do it again. Oh! Yo, where'd you go? Do Yo, bro, stop! Ah! Thank you. Yo. Ah, no, sorry, still cap. Chapter 4 of Season 4's new storyline has just been revealed. It's true. The upcoming new season of Fortnite's storyline has actually been uncovered online. And we almost know exactly what's going on. There is a theory online that each season of Chapter 4 is a reverse version of our Chapter 1 season. Let me explain. In Chapter 4 Season 1, Stellan the Rift Warden built a Rift Gate, which happens to have some similarities of Chapter 1 of Season 10, in which the visitor built 
build some rift gates. Both are rift related. Maybe just a coincidence. Chapter 4 of season 2. We had a futuristic season with a giant futuristic city. And that just happens to be exactly the same as chapter 1 of season 9, which had Neo tilted. Fast forward onto chapter 4 of season 3. This season, we have a tropical theme, which would actually seem to tie up pretty nicely with chapter 1 of season 8's theme, which was also a tropical theme, both featuring forest, jungle locations, and pirate-like adventurers. It seems chapter 4 is simulating the themes of each season of chapter 1, but in reverse. And even within the new season of Fortnite, this season right now, that still seems to hold up pretty darn well. If this theory is true, then that would mean the next season of Fortnite would have the same theme as chapter 1 of season 7, which was the season with the arrival of the Ice King and an icy biome to Fortnite. The Ice King came to our game on an iceberg. The iceberg slowly melted, revealing a castle. We never really found out what was going on with the story line with the Ice King. But if this reverse theory is to go ahead, we should expect Chapter 4 of Season 4, the upcoming season, to be a snowy winter theme. Presumably with some kind of icy biome and maybe even an Ice King. In our look, Max, that's all well and good. But do you have any evidence that this might actually be the case beyond just a theory? Well, the truth is, yes. Oh my goodness. Yo, what is that bro doing? Hold on. Bro, oh, what is the chances of this guy right behind me? Come on. Run away. Run away. And the final right now. Epic Games is working on a winter variant of the Ageless Champion. You remember from chapter 4? The Ageless was the king boss character that could be found at the castle location. Well, the survey has revealed that Epic Games is working on a snowy version of him. And as he's completely disappeared from the storyline, we expect him to come back. And this outfit right here seems to be the evidence for it. And not just this. Apparently, Brand's new secret dialogue related to the Ageless has just been added in Season 3. If you interact with Volpus, one of the new Season 3 outfits, whilst wearing the Ageless outfit, he says, We took care of Snowheart and the Icy Red Knight. Now you owe me a favor or two. What this secret dialogue exactly means, we're not entirely sure. But it is Brand's new secret dialogue for a character we thought had disappeared. Maybe not. If the Ageless champion, the king, is going to be returning to our chapter 4 island in a winter variant version. But presumably our island is going to be winterized snowy, which would actually tie up perfectly with chapter 1 of season 7, which was a snow theme. It turns out if this is true, then this reverso theory actually already explains exactly the theme of the brand new season of Fortnite. And even one of the main characters. We really might be looking at the beginning of the next season of Fortnite already. Yo, that's kind of crazy. Bro, I thought that was a player for a minute. Bro. Bro, I thought that was a player. Bro, there is literally players all around us. Ah! Run away, run away, run away. <laughs> Why is that on fire? What is going on? What is going on? Where are these people? Why are they invisible? Easy. Why have they got the best gun in the game? I don't know. Maybe I just deserve it. Maybe I really deserve it because of the whole key card meow source thing. I feel like maybe that's just karma catching back up with me and kicking me in the teeth. Bro, that is crazy. Bro, I literally don't even remember the last time I got a victory royale. I like literally can't even picture it in my head. When was the last time I ever won a game of Fortnite? Oh my goodness. I'm bad at games.